Well, Reese, that must have felt really good to get back out there. Yeah, it's been a, a really long time, you know, since I played. You know, the first time I've actually played this year, and uh, I've been working, you know, so hard to come back and, you know, make sure I could come back in, you know, in good shape and help the team as much as I can. Yeah, I mean, help the team as much as you can. It took all of three minutes for you to get the assist, so you certainly did that. That must be an incredible feeling when you when you get to help the team straight away. Yeah, I mean. Um, I try my best, you know, crossing is, you know, one of my, my strong attributes and uh, I had the opportunity, you know, to put a ball on on the plate for Nicholas and, uh, you know, it's, a, it's a good he, he took his chance as well. Psychologically, it must be really important for you to get some game time before the end of the season so, you know, you're not having to wait until next season starts. Yeah, I mean, the process has been, you know, real slow. Um, you know, at the start, they probably told me I was out for three months and it's been, you know, five months. Um, so it's taken its toll, you know, on, on my head as well. You know, it's been tough um, and, and especially long days. But I'm, you know, I'm so happy to be, you know, back and, and fit now. And you took a whack from one of their players quite early on. I know that's always quite an important moment, isn't it? To, to, to feel that hit and, OK, body can take that and on we go again. No, I wouldn't call that one a hit. <laughs> <laughs> I was just buying the foul. <laughs> Still clever. Uh, Big win, isn't it? You know, away from your own performance, to come back like that, keep the pressure on those European places. We're in great form right now. No, for sure. You know, when we went two on down, you think, oh, you know, their, their fans are behind them. This is going to be, you know, tough to claw one back and then, you know, get a winner. But, um, you know, I think, I think this win shows how far we've come. Maybe at the start of the season, we wouldn't have, you know, fought back today. Um, and, uh, yeah, I think that's credit to the team and the manager, um, you know, that we, we, we didn't give up and we showed character. Two big games left then, Brighton next. You scored there before, didn't you? So you'll be looking forward to some more game time there if possible? Yeah, Brighton are another, you know, another amazing team. It's going to be a, a super tough game, but um, you know, we focus on ourselves and try and you know, finish the season off in the best way possible. Maurizio, congratulations. What, what a win. You must be absolutely delighted. Yeah, so pleased, happy. I think we suffered a little bit on the end, but uh, yeah, so happy because I think uh, the way that we managed the pressure on the last 10-15 uh, minutes, I think, was was fantastic. We show uh, uh, very um, the resilience and, and the maturity to to compete until today. Must be particularly pleasing for a coach when your substitutions pay off so quickly as they did today. You, you, your plan worked perfectly. Yes, always it's important no, to have players with experience and quality on the bench that can uh, make an impact. And today I think it was fantastic. And, and of course, um, so happy, so pleased because the three points gave us, uh, give us the hope to, to be in an European competition next season. We're finishing the season really strongly, aren't we? You must be really pleased with the resilience the players are showing to, to go behind and then yeah, come back. It's the most important thing to finish strong. Always is connected the things. When you finish strong, I think. Um, always the energy is contagious and next season is to prepare the season and, and then to, to have um, a very good feelings, you know, to start the season in a very good way. So we can take what's happening now into next season, you feel? Of course, always is, is related and, and of course it's to, to finish strong, to start strong after in the next season. And we've been so strong at Stamford Bridge of late, maybe not quite had the results away from home. So again, that must really please you that you've picked up three points today. No, of course, it's really important away from home to to have a good balance and it's strong to fix the situation in Stamford Bridge. But I think also if we want to be in a position to fight for big things, is you need to to behave like uh, or to perform like uh, you perform in 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 Stamford Bridge. Uh, at home or away from home, is I think the team need to perform uh, in the same way. I must ask you about Rhys James as well, immediate impact from him. We know the problems we've had with injuries all season, but he showed the quality that he's got within yes. three minutes. No, of course, there's no doubt about his quality. It's only about that was a, it's a little bit unlucky that we two, only two, plays, uh, two games to play, and it's only one week and, and we finish the season. Well done. Good luck You're for welcome. Wednesday. You're welcome. perfectly happy where you are and your intentions are to stay on in the long term as long as Todd is the only are happy with you. It's all been blown up out of something out of nothing, is it? I never say that I, I, I am not happy. No, that's what I'm, I'm clarifying with you. Yeah, I never say that. I say maybe I am happy, maybe I am not happy. But I never say I am not happy. But it's normal. 
headline or headline. And, and sometimes it's, you know, too much honesty talking, you know, um, but it's not a problem. I, I have, I have uh, one, year, one uh, year more in my contract. And always, like I, I said uh, yesterday, uh, I think in always in long term, uh, thinking that this is going to be for a life here, um, and we work because we are professional, and thinking in to win games and and to try to make happy, you know, the owners make happy uh, all the staff that is uh, that we are in charge because I am responsible that all staff in, in on the training ground in Coban, trying to make happy the player and trying to make happy the fans. That is my my job. Easy. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. So easy. Kieran. I'm Hello. Um, it wasn't the easiest atmosphere for you guys to walk into, but it must be happy with all the players. No. The no, it's true. That was today they were celebrating, and I think they full credit to... Nottingham Forest to be one season more in, in the Premier League. I think with all the circumstances, I think they. I want to congratulate Nuno and all the staff and the and the club because they made a fantastic job. Um, yes, always it's difficult when you play against a team like um, is uh, cele celebrating, you know, big things. I think the the freedom for the player is is always um, they can give better performance and they have more energy. It's true that we start well the game and we score and then we concede a goal that we cannot score in this way and then it was really tough. It was an even game. I think we controlled the game, but they were very, very dangerous in all the transition. They have very good player, you know, that transits so fast and they create some, you know, we take some risk, they create some chances. Uh, and always you need <clears throat> a talented player, you need a player from the bench made a big impact, like uh, happened today, and a little bit lucky to, to win the games. And today, I think all the ingredients were for us. So happy because I think the, the important thing is always to believe and never give up. And I, I think the team showed the resilience and, and the maturity, you know, to fight, and, uh, to fight until to the end. That is why I, I am so pleased, because maybe you cannot play, maybe and to perform like uh, was uh, West Ham or Tottenham. But I think uh, in this type of game, uh, you need to be more mature and sometimes to play another football, that always is important too, if you want to be, uh, be in a position, in a higher position on the table. No? And one of the guys off the bench, Reese James, got his assist within two minutes and 53 seconds of coming on. Yes. His first appearance since December. It must be massive to have him. Massive. I'm lucky that uh, only we have two, two games you know, ahead and it's one week. Uh, but it's important for him to recover his feeling. So important play for us. He's our captain. Uh, I think we all love him. And yes, important and see if he can be, you know, also fit to to have the chances to to play the Euros. No. Cool. You're welcome. Yeah, sorry, so I was going to say, you, you, you think he does still have a chance of making that England squad? Well, I think we continue. To, I think we have one week more to work. And yes, I think he's doing well in the training session. It's true that after. Um, four or five months. It's not the same to tr to train that compete, but I think if he has the possibility to compete in the next two games and be involved, I think, yes, I think if after his coach on the national team believes that he can be, you know, and cope with the competition, I think he will be ready. And do you think, sorry, do you think Chelsea have genuinely turned the corner, Maurizio, in the three league wins in a row? Yeah, but you like the, uh, to see all the numbers and data. I think if you see that we are punished because of the first 10 games, I think not because our performance is because the chances that we create, we were not clean enough. I think we, in this first 10 game, to have uh, four, in between four and eight points more, I think today will be in a complete different position. I think if you start to count after the the game that we played against Tottenham that was the number 10. Until today, I think we played 26 games. And if you start to count from there, I think we are in the top four or in the top five for sure, you know, with a very good, uh, some very good performance. And that is not to, because you asked me, no? But I think uh, to assess 
the last 26 game, I think is uh, for the, all the circumstances, when you put all the circumstances in, in the middle and you analyze and you assess the, the season, I think is, uh, we are 